Okay, day 102, 102 consecutive days of walking at least one mile. I'll put the camera on, we'll get going. All right. I'm on a street that I have never driven on or walked on before, but I've driven by a million times. Actually in the city of Lawndale. And it's just a, uh, several, there's several of these little side streets. So I gotta walk up, down one side and back the other. Do a few of them. I've never walked down these streets. Kind of car with no front. Something. Got a red door. I don't know what these streets are gonna show. The Aqua House. Day Sleeper, it says. Daydream Believer. Let's see what we see down here. Oh, I gotta start the timer. Goodness. All right, put in your guesses how far I'll go, how long it'll take. Got a nice little wreath on their door. Like I said, I've never been down this street before. Let's see, this Camaro. How many muscle cars will we see? We'll put it at four and a half. What color is that? It's like a, a blue of some sort. I don't know, blue gray, light gray. Pretty good looking car. Camaro. Must be a really late model. A little dog barking at me. Full of sound and fury signifying nothing. Those Pomeranians, man. They love to bark. <laughs> He's got kind of a high bark for a little dog. I mean, a deep bark for a little dog. Uh-oh, this is posted no trespassing keep out what they got going on there man you got it all covered up they don't want anybody in there oh there's a rivian a rivian truck how about that it's kind of a interesting little street man they got a lot of pots it's like a, I don't even know what they got, pot of it. Begonias and like tomatoes and all kinds of stuff. Dog is still barking. He can't even see me. Down the railroad tracks over here. officially Lawndale, which is very borders of a Redondo Beach. I never really walked on these streets before. I don't think. I don't think I've ever even driven on it. Look at that. They got two houses and one house. They opened it. Had, I guess they had one house and divided it into two or something. Just alike. Maybe they're related or something. You can walk down here. There's one way. The railroad track. They want to put a metro train parallels this railroad track. Usually a train comes by about this time of day. It's pretty dangerous. There's no nothing up. coming right now. Walk down here a little bit. Let's say a Honda. Sixty-eight. 
and these houses are right here by the railroad. They put in another metro, they're going to be right on top of their houses. I want to put two lanes in. There'd be a track, a train coming by every five minutes, 20 hours a day. Doesn't sound that exhilarating. <laughs> All right, let's see what else is going on. Maybe we can go up another street, something. Some bougainvillea. They saw that plant. Uh, somebody had a shrub cut into the form of a dinosaur the other day. It's a couple days ago, and he was eating this colored bougainvillea. Love, the bougainvillea loves the sun. It comes out about this time of year and blooms this time of year. And oh, sheer, very vibrant colors purple and red and magenta. Uh oh, they're moving out for sale. Moving out to the country. Yeah, sunny, sunny move out to the country. Getting away from that train. They got a punching bag in their front yard. How about that? That's something. Look at that. Come out here and do some boxing or something, I guess. Well, they got some nice yellow roses here. Look at this. Beautiful. A little bird out there or something. There he is. Look at him. <laughs> Beautiful. I don't know what he's like. A not a parakeet. He's not talking though. Just enjoying the weather, I guess. It's like a cop car. A Crown Victoria, and there's a town, Lincoln Town car. I don't think it was a cop car. Maybe? Nah. All right, how many muscle cars will we see? I forgot to set the number, but it's gonna appear we're gonna see a lot. We'll say three and a half, we've seen one. I don't think we're gonna see many dogs either. I'll say two and a half. Is this a, a what a 370 Z? Never heard of 370 before. I wonder if that's for real. I don't know, it kind of looked like it'd been modified. Some kind of something all covered up. Yeah. I don't know what that is. Got a motorcycle too. Not gonna find out. Definitely different. There's that green truck, I think. No, that's a different green and white truck. And you see it all the way across. I don't know if you can see it too well on camera. It's coming this way. I don't know if that's the one I saw that was. I think it must be. Yeah, it's beautiful, all redone. See it a little bit, there he goes. I don't know what it is, I've seen it parked. It's all redone. The Dodge or GMC or, I don't know, let me know if you know. That's interesting, that's the third car, parked car I've seen on the street that's been, been driven. I've seen it on the street several times and now I've seen it driven. I saw that truck, which I don't know what it is from the 50s. Then I saw uh, uh, El Camino a couple days ago that went to jacked up in the back. I've seen that on the street several times from the 70s. And then I saw that uh, 60s uh, 
Ford Galaxy. Saw that on the street several times and I saw it being driven the other day. Kind of unusual. You can see how these cars parked on the street and now I'm seeing them actually being driven. Let's go see what's down this little street. It's another little small little street it goes to the railroad tracks. The street looks a little cleaner than the other one. Look at this tree. It's coming all out the side to the front. It's interesting. Oh, they got a bunch of them over here in the front, too. There's a butterfly. Look at this. It's kind of neat trees. Got a boat for sale. There's another one of them. I don't know what they... They bloom this type of year, this time of year, or what? Three or four of them in a row. It's kind of a little bit different street than the other one. Looks a little neater, cleaner. I never walked on these streets, the little side streets, and not very long. And I got a cactus going up there. Big old American flag that right in the middle of their yard it lights up. You get a light on it at night. But that looks nice. They got a trampoline in their front yard. A whole bunch of birds going on it. Right in front of me. <laughs> Having a good old time. Look at them. There's the trampoline, there's all the little birds. They're just having a good old time together. Making a lot of noise. <laughs> they're fighting or playing, I think they're playing. Look like young birds. They're not eating. They're just tweeting and playing. There they go again. Having a good old time. All right. I thought you'd see more muscle cars. I haven't really seen us. The one Camaro. Another American flag. That's always a good sign. That looks like an old street sign up there from days, days gone by. Look at that. I don't know. Well, these houses go right up against the railroad tracks here. <laughs> they build a metro. We're going to be looking at it all day long. Every five minutes, 20 hours a day. Can't imagine they'd be too happy about that. There's a little squirrel. He's not coming over. This little street, just a little, little streets. A lot of more cars on this one. Look at a big green house. Look at that. The two on a lot. Really surprised. I haven't seen more muscle cars on these little side streets. Like a track homes from the 60s, right here. One, two, three. 
a little two bedroom one bath I think still around from the 60s like four in a row still here then you got this house much bigger it's the torn it down a little track home and built this big house like it's from the 80s maybe and back to the little track home wow is this a house now, is it a commercial building? I'm not sure what this is. It goes way back. Way back. Like six bedrooms or something. That's one house. Maybe it's two or three. Oh, yeah. It's two or three. That's an A. So they probably got three of them. Yeah. Or two at least. Yeah, two. We got two right beside each other. There's another American flag. It's an old VW. That's early 60s. Look at the small tail lights. Probably 60, 61, 62. I don't know what the first year of those uh, VWs are. I didn't even look it up. Let me know if you know. That's one of the oldest VWs I've seen. It's got to be like 61, 62. Doesn't look like they drive it. It's flat tires. White walls are completely flat. interesting all right i think i can do one more one more of these little side streets we got a green door back there look at that it's green green neon green one more of the little streets and turn back whoa there's a bright green something down there it's like a van or something you can see it too well with the camera. I think I've seen that, that car on the road before. I, think I made a maybe made a thumbnail out of it on St. Patrick's Day, maybe. Yeah, like a van of some sort. I don't know how well you can see it. Oh, they got a got a neon green, a VW bus, and a Corvette over there. White Corvette. Guess I could run over there. Let's see, since they got some interesting cars. It customized it. I don't know what it is. Chevy? I don't know. Pretty cool. The wheels on it. We got something else covered up over here. I don't know what it is. We got a VW bus. I got a Corvette. Late model Corvette and a Cadillac. Traded in his Chevy for a Cadillac. Corvette. Man. Got a lot of nice cars. Hey, the Corvette, that's an Escalade. It's a second muscle car. And then we got a Charger over here. It's a third muscle car.
past this other little side street and head back up. Just a little detour there. All right, no dogs. No delivery trucks. Three muscle cars. Another little side street, not as many cars. Basketball goal right there. A helicopter that must be going on. Uh oh. I don't know if you can see it. It's like a news chopper. Like channel 7 or 5, maybe channel 5. I can't really tell. Yeah, 5. Uh oh. I wonder if they got a escaped convict or something car chase maybe see if he comes back around better look out there's a little half a car no another cube i don't know it's not a cube it's a, i don't know it's a nissan now people like those half square cars it's a nissan cube they look like a cube it's driving a square box. Oh, here's an old car. Flat tires, too. See what it is. I don't know. I'm going to find out. Like a foreign car of some sort. It's a Datsun. Wow. It might be from the 50s. I've never seen a Datsun that old before. Look, it's got the little Thunderbird uh, windows in the back. That's pretty neat. Thunderbird came out with those in the 50s because it was a blind spot and they put those little rear view mirrors in the back. Datsun 1600. How oh, neat. Let me know if you know what year that is. I think it's from the 50s. Probably copied that little circle, in the rear, not a rear view mirror, circle mirror in the back seat from the Thunderbird, so in the 50s I would guess that's pretty neat I never seen I didn't know Datsuns were that old we had a Datsun B210 the mid 70s when the oil crisis came out and couldn't get gas they were rationing gas you could only go get gas on Monday Wednesday Friday or something whatever your name last name began with it's the only day you could get gas and we bought a little Datsun. Hello, buddy. Bots Datsun B210. It was about the color of this orange thing up here. And uh, like 35 miles to the gallon instead of 12 in a big old Buick we had. Got rid of the Buick for a little Datsun. It's an 80s, like an 80s BMW here, I think. Looks like 80s. Like it's been in a couple of wrecks. That Datsun was about this color, except it was a little bit more orange. The one we had. Datsun B210. Still remember it. A nice house here. Right next to the railroad tracks. No bueno. They are not happy about it. Look, they got no metro trains, all kinds of stuff right here. All right, head back. Somebody over there eating on a stump. Maybe he rides the rails or something. It's a hobo. I don't know. And no, no train coming by. Usually come by around this hour. 
All right. Yeah, that was interesting. Head back. I only see something. That old VW bug and Dachshund, what was it, 1600? There's big old cactus here. It's like a light green. Kind of neat. We see it. Oh, yeah, we saw that. Neon green van of some sort. The Corvette. Camaro color I'd never seen. Oh, you see three, three or four muscle cars. Here's these day glow daisies. Super bright. Boy, look at them. Nice. Right in the middle of a yellow fire hydrant. They are bright. Oh, that's kind of neat. The yellow part of the, the daisy matches the fire hydrant. Interesting. It's cool. They bloom this time of year. Beautiful. <laughs> they match the fire hydrant. I like that. on the other side of the tracks another day exploring another part of the neighborhood a lot different from Manhattan Beach area I tell you that what is this signal? I don't know what that thing is for this car I guess I'll find out seen it a few times now just doesn't say what kind of car it is nowhere Yeah, let me know if you know what it is, because I don't know what it is. It's got that thing on the hood. Trademark of some sort. I don't know what it is. Don't know. It's a Ford Probe. That's from the 80s, I believe. Not the long-lasting... I think that car lasted that long. I've heard of the name. So weird, you can just walk right up to the train tracks. go by you can go up there and touch it or get run over and get killed there's another little squirrel what's that that's I wonder if that's a time capsule I don't know this night I think it says I don't know I thought it said 1983 but I can't really read it now something I don't know Kind of a, almost like an alley. Parallels a railroad track. Yeah, palm trees next to the railroad track. How about that? Let's see if any of these get to the other side of the tracks on any of these streets here. So I'll know for next time. gate on all of them. I can get across right there. Oh, I don't know. There's a kitty. Meow. Meow. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Meow. I don't think you'll come over, but we could try. 
kitty, kitty, kitty. Meow. Two kitties. Here's a black one. That one's not coming over. You get through right there. You know, one. Maybe I'll go one more street for two more streets where I park. Three kitties. I got another gray one there. Meow. Meow. All right. Next. That's another cat. They got four cats. Way back over there by the red fence. Five cats. <laughs> they got another one there. Like at least five cats. Yeah, it looks like I could get by there around 166th if I wanted to cut over next time. Yeah, the fence is all up around here. Never really walked the railroad tracks before. It's so weird that there's no fences or nothing. Just walk right up to it. I never walked over there on that side of the tracks. I don't know if I've ever really even driven over there. I think this uh, part of the video is getting ready to cut off. It usually does after about 30 minutes. I don't know where they're going to put these other tra train. Two over there, I guess. Yeah, that's about it. Really hard to get across over there. The gate's up all the way down. This is my street, though. I'm not gonna walk up another one. I guess I, nah, it's too far. Pretty sure this is where I parked. Yep. This old Dodge Ram truck up here. Check that out. In the 70s? I think I missed that on the way out. I don't think they drive it too much. Nope. Got full of stuff. Hasn't been driven since 2022. I just use it for storage or something. Tires are flat. Prospector. How you doing? Lawndale. All right. Well, that was different. The other side of the tracks. Is this dog still barking? A little a Pomeranian or something. He sits up in that chair and barks at people all day, I guess. Stay away. The little dogs love to protect. All right, that's pretty much it. If you guessed 1.31 in 33 minutes and 22 seconds, you are the winner. And that's it for today. I'll put a recommendation for a video you might like.
let me know. Make sure you subscribe. Trying to get a few subscribers. <laughs> so I can come. And uh, let me know what part of the walks you like.